Ladies and gentlemen, it's the 12th of August, 2015, and I'm going to do a quick video blog for you. I like the, wor the word fragile. Fragile. Okay? <laughs> it's hard to say that. Fragile. You know when you get a shipment, you get a package, and it says fragile. Handle with care. You ever seen that? Okay. Because if it moves too much, it might break and the stuff inside it may be damaged. In today's world, people live as if they have a sticker on them that says fragile. Be careful. Don't hurt their feelings. Watch out. You don't want to upset anybody. Be a good little boy. Be a good little girl. Make sure that everybody is agreeing with you. Don't rattle the cage anywhere. You might upset people. Right? Fragile little things. They make us think we are. Well, there's another way to look at it. I don't think you're fragile. I know I'm not. Take a look. Every single major change in your life. When I say major, I mean life-changing decision. Has come because you were challenged by life in a way that was upsetting, hurtful, maybe even devastating. During those times, you decided that things are going to be different from now on. That you're going to either take a stand or speak your mind or, or do what you need to do or take control of your life. Or never again, let's say, you know, trust somebody who lied to you. Never again this, or from now on you're always going to work out or feel good. You know, it happens when life challenges you. You're not as fragile as maybe you're led to believe. In fact, I think you're quite resilient. You know what that word means? Bounce back. Not only that. There's other words that would describe a package that had a Rosh Bazaar in it. You can see yourself as unbreakable because I tell you something, you're not broken yet. You might be hurt, but you're not broken yet. How do I know? Because you're listening to this. They haven't broken you yet. You may have arrows in you. You definitely have scars all over your fucking life. But you're not broken. So don't fucking act broken. It takes a lot to break the human spirit. It takes a constant barrage of, of information, misinformation, and constant stream of you're no good and hate yourself. And still to this day... You're not broken. I sure as fuck am not. And I know nobody can break me. I know this till my last breath. And after whatever comes up. They'd better be prepared wherever I go next. Because if they couldn't break me in this shithole, they're not breaking me anywhere else. It can be unbreakable. Take a look at the challenges that are you're facing and know something. You're going to come out of them and you're going to come out of them changed. So just like the animal, the fish that comes onto land and deals with the pain and eventually grows gills, or not gills, lungs, and little, little flippers become feet and starts walking, that evolution is also apparent in your life and in my life. 
as, as the world pushes on you, as the world challenges you, you challenge it back. And you realize that during the interaction of you and circumstances, you will be changed. So make sure that you change the way you want to change. You guide your change. That is the one principle of life that you can't deny is change. So stop being so scared of it. Embrace it and guide it. Unbreakable. Resilient. Be a beast. A beast. Be a monster. Be a god. Be an angel. Be a demon. Be a vampire. Be a wolf. Be a lion. Or just be a genuinely incredible human being. Well, whatever you decide to be, be strong. Be focused. Be willing to go through the shit because everybody is going through the shit. Just shake it off, clean up, and keep going in the direction that you want to go. Until you die, you're still playing the game. You're in it. So do your best. I know everybody's struggling. Okay? You go, Rosh, you're not struggling. I refuse to. But I've had my struggles. Now, they're no longer struggles. They're opportunities. There's a big difference. I have challenges just like everybody else. I just really go after them. If challenges in life were alive, they would know what? A Rosh motherfucking d -bazaar is coming. And there ain't no stopping me. Be brave. That doesn't mean you're not going to have fear. It means act in the face of fear. If your action is something that is worthy and worthwhile in life, if it's survival, act. It doesn't mean that being scared is not going to happen. But the action counts after being scared. That's what matters. You're not fragile. I refuse to believe that anybody around me is fragile. I've proven it over and over with the women in my life. I've proven it with my students. I don't acknowledge weakness in others. I acknowledge strength in them. And God forbid anybody ever try to pity me for anything. I'm proud of every single thing I've ever gone through in my life. And I'm proud of everything I will go through in my life. I'm happy for every single person who's left my life. Good riddance. Thank God I can't stand you. And I hope you lose for the rest of your life. And watch us win. And I'm happy for every new friend, every new fan, and every new ally that comes into my life. Welcome to my life. Welcome to a life of power and freedom and focus like you've never seen before. Welcome to a life of ambition that, that's brighter than the fucking sun. It's the reality. Okay? You're not fragile. Stop talking to yourself like you're fragile. Stop talking to your children like they're fragile. Stop talking to your lovers like they're fragile. Stop talking to your employees and employers like they're fragile. Stop talking to the world like they're fragile. Let the world know they can be strong, that there's another choice. That you don't have to accept the complaining and the bullshit that everybody's walking around with their shoulders hunched over, a head down, telling the world how humble they are. Fuck their humility. Fuck their humility. It's fake. It's fake humility. The lion is not humble. The tree is not humble. The eagle is not humble. The sun is not humble. The moon is not humble. And Rosh motherfucking Diva Zahar is not humble. I just am. Natural. Express yourself. Fuck them if they can't adjust, as Tupac said. Be the best. Fuck the rest. I am C Nation.